everyone, welcome to What's Cooking in Worcester, a cooking series featuring nutritious and delicious takes on some of our favorite recipes. Winter is right around the corner, so that means cold weather. And if you're anything like me, there's nothing I enjoy better on a cold day more than a hot bowl of soup to warm you up and take the chill off. However, a lot of the store-bought canned soups are very high in sodium. You can tell this by looking at the nutrient facts. So let's look at two different popular soups. Anything about 20% or over your daily value is considered high. Anything below 5% is considered low. This first can has about 28% of your daily value of sodium. The second can has about 39% of your daily value of sodium but it also has two and a half servings. So if you eat two and a half servings, which would be the whole can, you would really be getting 97.5% of your daily value of sodium. The good news is the recipe I'm going to be sharing with you today has only 6% of your daily value of sodium in one cup. First, I'm gonna cut and prepare all of my ingredients. So here I have two carrots, peeled and chopped one large onion, chopped, one cup of chopped cabbage, green cabbage, and then one medium zucchini chopped. Now, if you hear me say chopped and diced, the difference is chopped is a larger piece and diced is a smaller piece. So now that I have all of my ingredients chopped and prepared, I'm just gonna give my pot a light coat of cooking spray. So now I'm just gonna turn it on to low heat. I'm going to add my carrots and my onions. I'm going to add my broth. You can do chicken broth or you can do vegetable broth. Uh, but when you do buy the broth, try to choose the lower sodium option. So I'm just going to add this in. Then I'm going to add my chopped green cabbage. Next, I'm gonna add my cut green beans. Uh, again, you could probably find a no salt added option to make this healthier, uh, not drained. So we're gonna add the liquid and the green beans right into the soup. And I'm gonna add my 1 uh, teaspoon of garlic powder and my half a teaspoon of Italian seasoning. I'm gonna turn the heat up to a medium high and bring it to a boil. After we've brought it to a boil, we're going to reduce the heat to low and cover. We'll allow this to simmer for about 15 minutes or until the carrots are tender. Then we'll stir in our zucchini. Okay, so it's been about 15 minutes, so I'm going to check my soup here. And you want to cook it about 15 minutes or until the carrots are tender. So we're going to add the zucchini in next. One thing I want to mention too is I use the yellow onion for this recipe. Usually yellow onions are better for soups and cooking. So I'll cover it again and simmer it for about three to four minutes or until the zucchini is tender. So once everything looks tender, we can go ahead and turn the stove top off and we'll go ahead and serve it up. 